Hello everyone and welcome to another vlog. Today I'm up early enough to go to a car boot, maybe two, so let's go and see what the car boots have to offer. We're trying a different car boot today and it costs 50p for adults but the kids are free so hopefully this is a good one. What I find with car boots is like the first couple of rows of people who are regulars here all the time and basically try to sell rubbish but then when you get like three or four like rows in you get the good stuff you get the families you get the kids so fingers crossed this looks quite big so let's see what we find we've been up and down four rows now and some people are asking extortionate prices i picked up a pair of school shoes which are the kickers ones and they had like all scuffs and stuff on but i thought well they're okay for like school shoes for one of the girls i asked how much and she said 12 pound 12 pound they're actually selling in the sale for that brand new on amazon i was like expecting a pound or two pound crazy but i got a coat for a pound a winter coat for bella and I've got a DVD that I wanted to watch what's not on Netflix so we'll keep looking and I'll let you know how I get on. So I found a really good store and that was a lady and basically she had all next clothes. Most of them were babies but I managed to find a few in Bella size. Now 25p, look at this. How cute is that? Wow. And it's got an insect on it at the moment, but I all darling and I also got this Peppa Pig top for 25p. But my favourite has to be Belle. How pretty is that? <laughs> all these books are 10p each and we're getting these two, including this with Lego in, and this Disney Princess one. So we're gonna be getting those. Mm. Do you keep hold of those? Look. So it's about 11 o'clock now and we're on next car boot. I like this one the best so hopefully we can get some good stuff. I'm quite disappointed in car boots now because there's so many like traders. Even when you just go to a store and you think it's normal and then they ask for a stupid amount so not that successful but we'll have a look. So I'm not finding a lot here today to be honest with you. It's been quite unsuccessful. But I'm gonna keep looking, got two more rows. Don't know what Callum is doing. The car boots were a bit disappointing, so we're gonna look around some other shops and the first one is Poundland. Hopefully this won't be disappointing. Let's go in. They have semi-permanent pastel hair colours and these last for 10 washes. They have pink and blue and they also have silver. These are quite nice, these are wooden puzzles. They have the dinosaur one, they have a tractor. And they have, yeah, some letters. So they're really nice for stocking fillers. Paw Patrol dinner plate and a bowl. Two cups there. And they also have cutlery. They have the Hunger Games on Blu-ray with 3D glasses. We're in the pet care aisle right now and they've got Disney Princess socks for dogs. And they also have like Monsters Inc. ones. This is a heart shaped pet bowl, but you could use that for other things. It's really nice. I'm getting a couple of these ice trays because they're really handy because they have silicone on the back. So you just press it to pop the ice cubes out. Really good colour changing butterflies for your garden. Quite pretty. So I've just spotted these. They say Series 1 Disney Mini Figure Worlds and it looks like a pen and then like a little model and it's got a hologram on it. So this looks like something what could have been in one of like the loot crates or something like that. But they have Donald, Mickey Mouse, but it doesn't really look like Mickey but it's the 1928 one from Plain Crazy and then painted on a duck so yeah they're quite good one of my followers asked me to show the craft stuff in poundland now these are fabric tapes and there's a few designs to choose from and these are free for a pound they also have wooden pegs so you get 60 in there they have some glittery sheets of paper have some little bows here which are great if you are making cards also a paper pad yep this is like a pad of paper some design gems here 
some Dynamante or Diamante glitter stickers and yep, a few other craftings. So we're left Homeland now and we're in M&S because I love their food. I think it's a bit early to get like yellow stickers but keep an eye out anyway. I'm gonna grab a few bits for dinner. M&S has best of British strawberries and these are half price for £2. Now I will say M&S strawberries have so much flavour to them where the supermarket ones is always hit and miss if they're nice or not so £2 it's actually cheaper than Tesco at the moment. You can buy beer battered cod and scraps. There's a bag of scraps in there like the chip shop. To be honest with you, Marks and Spencers is quite reasonable, 40p for this bag of carrots and their fruit and veg is so nice so I'm going to get a bag of these. So we're just checking out in here and I'm really looking forward to dinner because this food is so tasty. I didn't buy a lot of the car boots but I thought I'd do a quick rundown. The first item I bought is a coat which is originally from M&S and this is for Bella in the winter. It was only a pound. I got three DVDs of movies that I want to watch but they're not on Netflix and they were 50p each. I got these Peppa Pig Jelly Sandaly shoes, they're for Bella and they were 50p. I got this really pretty dress, actually the camera doesn't do it justice, that was only 50p. I got this big book here which is a Disney princess one that was only 10p and also this other book was only 10p and it's got little Lego figures inside there so I'm not sure if all the bricks are in there but it's compatible with Lego so Molly will have it anyway. I got this Peppa Pig top this was 25p and my favourite out of everything is this bell top which was also 25p so that's everything I got I hope you enjoyed this vlog and until next time I'll see you soon.